at the end of a gun barrel. You think about what happens when a cop is shot. But it's not just any cop lying in that hospital room. It's Kevin O'Brien, and he's my friend. How is he? Oh, my God. The cop who gets shot is no abstraction, and neither is what happens next. It's all out, everything goes, no holes barred. Every cop in the city knows it could have been him. And he wants a piece of the man who did it. Shoot a cop, and you'd better have a pretty deep hole to hide it. How is he? They said he'd make it. 
you unconscious? In surgery. What happened? We got a tip on a drug deal. The guy makes us, splits, and starts shooting. You couldn't take him? He grabbed a guy in a car. It's on the air already. At least we grabbed his connection. Maybe he can tell us something. Anybody tell Nicky yet? No, I'm on my way over there right now. I was just hoping we could hear something. Well, get her down here. Make sure she's got everything she needs. And then I want you downtown right away. I don't want to waste a second on this. Uh, Lieutenant, the bastard's got Kevin's gun. the subway station. Who? I met him there, that's all. Who? Who said the subway station? Oh, give me a break, huh? I'll give you a break. His name's Larry Salvatore. He's got a gun and he's already used it. Use extreme caution when attempting to apprehend this suspect. He got his plates and his picture. Blow him to hell if you have to. I don't want any more cops shot. Did you hear anything? They're still working on him. Won't hear anything until he's out of surgery. You'll let me know. Yeah, yeah, you, you, you'll be the first to hear. What about the one you arrested? Can well, we help? we've got Colby going over with him now. Elaine, do yourself a favor. Don't go near that one. Well, I was No. Just... You've never been around here before when there's a cop shot. That's something they don't teach you at law school. I'll be in my office. I want a name. I told you. I'm just meeting a guy. How do I know he's gonna start shooting? You know now, Turkey? Huh? Your friend shot a cop, huh? Huh? Who started up? I want a name. Come on. I'd tell you anything if I could. Because this is how it's gonna be, man. White bread, you and me, for as long as you can stay conscious. Sit down. Sit down. It's all right. It's all right. I know. I know. Do you hear anything? Well, listen, I've got to get back. Yeah, of course. You call? As soon as we hear. Okay, and if you need anything, anything at all, it'll be all right, Frank. He's out of surgery. How is he? It went very well. Is everything all right? I'm sure it will be. What do you mean you're sure it will be? Is everything okay or isn't it? The doctor asked me to tell you. That's all I know. He'll be in recovery at least a couple of hours. I can let you know as soon as he's brought up to his room. Okay. Thanks. God, why don't they ever know anything? Tommy, take good care of her. To your right, please. Detectives will take your statement, Mr. Walker. Everything's gonna be all right. Jack Walker, Detective Brody. Hi, this is Detective Carson. Please sit down, right over here. Where'd you find it? Wandering over on Lombard. That could still be in the neighborhood. Did you put it in the air? Right away, we're covering the whole area. Okay, good. Was there anything that he might have said that could have indicated where he was going? He didn't say a word. He was gonna kill me. I swear he was gonna kill me. But he didn't, Mr. Walker. Now try to think, was there somewhere he was trying to get? He just kept pointing his gun at me the whole time. Keep ready. I got the name of the guy who set up the deal. J.B. Marsh. Well, get on. He's out of surgery.
relax, keep breathing, keep breathing. One more, one more. Co twist, one, two, three, twist, one, and another. One, two, three, four. Let's go, come on. One, two, three, four, five, six, and another, and another. So, you haven't screwed up enough for one day? Cops jumped us. What the hell am I supposed to do? You're supposed to use your head for something. We got lawyers. We got lawyers? I got this. Billy the Kid. What, are you gonna shoot your way out of town? No. You are gonna take care of me. I want 25 grand. Cash. 25 G's? You say cash? Go for 50. Go for 100. What's the matter with you? I kid around, Lenny. Who's kidding? Who's kidding who around here? You blew the deal. Now you're so hot I can hear you sizzle. You walk in here where anybody can see you. I had to let him break you in, too. What's the matter with you? I'm carrying your goods. You gotta help me out. That's right, Larry. Where's the goods? I got it, man. All of it. It's two kilos we're talking about here. Let's see it. I'm not walking around with it on me. I'll get it for you. You gotta give me some money, though. I gotta get out of town. You give me the stuff, I'll give you some dough. You give me the money, and then we'll talk. Don't squeeze me, Larry. I squeeze you. Get him out of here. Here, unload it, give it back to him. With any luck, he'll get himself shot. <clears throat> Look, we better let him get some sleep. Right. You'll be all right? I'm fine, I'm fine. Because if there's anything that you he's need... He's fine, he's fine. Oh. All right. Mm. I'll see you in the morning. Yeah. Take care of yourself, Tiger. Why should I? It's their job. Oh, it doesn't look too bad. Oh, Tommy, he looks awful. Well, more or less. It's my uncle, fellas. Let's get back to you. What's that, PC? You call me off. I'm a lot of the mainstream in here. Yeah, you're looking a little pale. That's not for you to say. Yeah, well, uh, we think everybody and your sisters are looking for this guy, huh? Except you, right? Yeah, well, it's not my fault. Tell you what, though, uh, you got to check with me next time you want to start moving and grooving in the drug subculture, huh? What would you have told me? Not a very nice person? <laughs> might have. Might not have told you squat either. <sighs> no, what I want to know is, uh, how you get a line on this guy, huh? You fish on your side, I'll fish on my side. Yeah, I'd have bet myself a couple beers, you might say something like that. Anyway, <laughs> I think I might have a story on a couple of these guys. When you're feeling up to it, why don't you give me a holler? I might be able to help, huh? Where's Marsh? Let's talk. Hey, I'm having a drink with my friends. Should just leave him. Say, y'all ain't got nothing to do? Got some lost property down at the station house. Want to drop by and claim it? I don't know what you're talking about. Whole suitcase full of cash. And this thing called Joey. It doesn't ring a bell. The copper was shot, was my partner. Maybe that rings a bell. My heart bleeds for you. What are you, crazy or something? Crazy? Yeah, I'm crazy. I'm gonna get crazy all over you. What do you want? Larry Salvatore. What do you think I want? I think you should get some exercise. Metro Health Club. The guy runs it. It's named Crane. Lenny Crane.
come to invest in our membership? Cut the crap, Crane. Let's talk. Want a sandwich? Spinach, bean sprouts, good for you. Maybe a papaya shake. You eat a lot of junk food in your job. No good. You need a little papaya now and then. It's cleansing. You know? I was my partner, your boy shot. What the hell's your partner got to do with me? Dave, come here. Dave Bliss, Frank Chambon. It's my lawyer. The detective here seems to think I had something to do with his partner getting shot. That's absurd. Uh, you intend to make an arrest here, officer? Not right now. What exactly do you intend to do? I intend to ask him a few questions. Well, I'm afraid I can't let my client answer them, officer. <laughs> Guess there's nothing more I can say. You don't want that sandwich? Okay, slow down, Kevin. All right. I don't think that you should walk I away. can walk. I can walk. You're supposed to stay off it's your feet. All right. And where might you be going? I'm trying to get out of here. Isn't that the idea? Not like that, it isn't. Told you. I can do it. I can walk. On somebody else's floor, maybe. Not on mine. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. All right. Lieutenant couldn't have made him do that. Tell me, Freddie, am I smooth or what? <laughs> you ought to hear what they're saying about you. I don't care what they're saying as long as they're talking. I'm getting every word. Yeah? Mm -hmm. What are you saying? Chair. What's up, my place? I got this one at the Salvation Army. It has a footrest. I cleaned it. You sit down, I'll make you something to eat. What are you doing? Checking to see it's here. have some uh, sick leave coming. Mm -hmm. Why don't we go away for a while? Just the two of us to, I don't know, to a beach or something. And do what? I can stand in the water like, like a pelican. <laughs> you mean a flamingo. A flamingo. Mm -hmm. Oh, it'd be good for you, for both of us. Don't even think about it. Let's just do it. I can't walk away from this, Nikki. You can hardly walk at all. I can't go anywhere, not with a guy running around with my gun. Yeah. Well, you're right. I'd probably just get sunburned anyway. Goodbye, goodies. You got that? Yeah. Yeah. Back to the Chinese bank. And leave the two humps at home. Don't worry about it. I'm coming along, all right? Right. Okay. Hello? Hi. Yeah. Let's see you. I get a feeling I'm not yeah? here anymore. Yeah, okay. We'll see you right there. Colby, we're on. What's going on? We got a line on Larry. What? Where? He's the guy who made the deal with Lenny Crane. Got his place bugged. Lenny isn't coming with you. Come on. Kevin, just stay right here, okay? I can't. All right, all right, I can't. Listen, as soon as we know something, I'll let you know, okay? Yeah. Thank you. 
Mr. Crane goes where the bucks are, Lieutenant. I was five blocks away waiting for a friend. What are you guys, crazy or something? Take him downtown, Freddy. And don't be too nice to him. What charge? What the hell you charge me with? Lieutenant, the slug was on the sidewalk. Must have gone right through him. Get it down to ballistics. Tell him to put a top priority on it. He's just still driving the same car. Well, that's a break, I suppose. Put it back on the air again. OK. Frankie. Yeah. Just a minute. I see that. What happened? We had him on a stakeout. A couple patrolmen spotted him first, and he t and they tried to take him. And they tried to take him, and what? Well, don't make me drag it out of you. He got away. And? He killed one of our cops. No. Gun. What kind of gun was it? I knew you were going to say that. What kind of gun was it? It was a 38. OK, there are a lot of 38s out there, Kevin. It's not your fault, Kevin. Had him, and I let him get away. I want everything. As soon as you hear it, I hear it, all right? You know that. And I'm telling you, we are going to get this guy. I promise you we're going to get him. looking for this guy. You killed a man with my gun. Look, they don't need you. I do. This is insanity. You can't even walk. Don't do it, Kevin. Look, I promised myself I would never get involved with a cop again. Don't make me sorry. It'll just be a little while. Kevin, Kevin, I can't go through it again. I don't have any choice, Nikki. Neither do I. I won't be here when you get back. Hey, come on, it's Larry. I give you a great deal, man. What do you say? I can meet you in a half hour.
Larry. Listen, I'm holding. Crazy calling me here or what? Don't worry about it. I'm cool. Yeah, if you said any cooler, you'd be dead, man. Shut up and listen. You know what I got, don't you? You got leprosy, Jack. I got two kilos. Ten grand a piece. I gotta get out of town. Interested? Does the goose fly? All right. Old train yard. Half an hour? Yeah. Okay. What am I, the soft touch around here? I can't get any answers out of anybody else. I can't even find anybody else. So come to Stevie. Look, there's a cop dead. Do you realize that? I have been playing that game since Kevin got shot. Well, I carry the same shield they do. Find someone else. You are holding Lenny Crane, and you don't even have a charge against him. What are you, his lawyer? I have been listening to his lawyer all night. Where are you holding Lenny Crane? Who? Lenny Crane. Don't play games with me, Frank. Oh, we ain't playing games here. I know what you're all going through, but there are laws. I don't give a damn. I was just... Hey, I don't give a damn. You know, the thing is, I wouldn't be saying this if I didn't, if I wasn't in love, man. Thank God. You know, I know it's sudden, but um. I want you to come home and meet my mom. <laughs> Be serious. Baby, you're looking at serious. So, what do you say we split, right? We go back to my place and uh, I make the introduction, huh? You still live with your mama? Well, no, she's in Georgia, but uh, I will call her. <laughs> Making you the happiest man in the world, you know that? Just, uh, don't go back. What the hell are you doing here, O'Brien? I'm looking for you. Yeah, well, you don't look in too good shape. I'm all right. You offered me some help. I'm off duty. So am I. You break a young girl's heart. You know that, don't you? I can see that. You can't tell me you let a guy go out with two keys. You don't know where to get him. How can you tell me that? How can you tell me you don't know where to find him? Because I don't know. How many times do I have to tell you? Till you get it right, Lenny. If I knew how to find him, if I knew where to find him, I'd find him. What do you think? You already know what I think. Yeah, you know whatever the hell I know. My joint's bugged. My phone's hot, ain't it? Everything you own's hot, Lenny. Then why don't you listen to the damn tapes? He called me. I didn't call him. I don't know what the hell to call him. You're gonna have to do better than that, Lenny. You're gonna have to do a hell of a lot better than that. If I did any better than that, there wouldn't be enough of that little weasel for you guys to fingerprint. Lock him up. We got better stuff to do. Lock me up for what? I'm working on it. Man. You set it up. You give me what I said, you're on Easy Street. You mess me around, you ain't nowhere. You understand that? Yeah, there, sure. Be sure. Because the trouble I'm in, it don't matter what I do now, does it? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Stuff somehow. And you don't have a line on this guy? Yeah, I don't know. He's one of Crane's animals. The guy uses maniacs, man. It's gonna get him killed one of these days. Yeah, well, he's got the stuff, 80 to 100 grand worth. Yeah, okay, so let's go see what's shaking, huh? Here we go, here we go, here we go. Come on, put your money down. No money, no winning. Where is he? 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 Where is he?
folks. Game's over. All right, there you go, sir. Thank you. Take it up. Thanks. All right, game. Bye. Right, that's in. it. I'm that's in. it. There you go. All right, see you. Come on, beat it. Got to wrap the violin. Hey, the music industry just ain't paying off anymore, O'Brien. Hey, what happened to being sick, huh? I'm all right. Well, that's not the paper said. The paper said you're almost dead. There's a guy who is dead. We got to talk, Whitey. Brian, I'll tell you right now, there's not a whole hell of a lot that I know, okay? I don't even know whose junk this guy was peddling. Yeah, okay, so we know that is. That ends the question. Well, give me the question. We want to know whose deal. <laughs> I mean, this guy had five friends, tops. I mean, no one's going to go near this guy now. All right, give me one. Give you one. It's a guy named Fingers. Uh, this guy, Fingers match it. <laughs> huh? I mean, this guy's a real sleazeball, though. I'll tell you right now, he'd sell smack to the Ayatollah. Whitey, set it up. Get it out. Look, O'Brien, I don't know if you noticed, but uh, this cheap mug is in all the papers. All right, so cut me into him, man. No, no, no. Come on, come on, come on. I don't want to do that kind of stuff, man. I mean, this guy, trust me, he's all right. No, we don't want him. We want his connection. I suppose you're going to tell me no one's going to get hurt, huh? Yeah, nobody's going to get hurt. Whitey, I am hurt. There is a cop down. I am not asking you for favors on this one. Say, Barkeep, I'm uh, looking for Joey Gunn. Hey, man, ain't you hurt? Joey's sick. Is that a fact? Yeah, the dude he was with drilled the cop. Hey, uh, what you doing looking for Joey? I'm a friend of his, why? Hey, you know him? Yeah, I've seen him around once in a while with Joey. Come on, let's talk. Hey, not you, Whitey. Come in for a slice of the action. Uh huh. Like how much? Well, how much you got? Hey, maybe two key. Nah, I need a little maybe slip. Hey, 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 sit down, sit down. Hey, listen, I can get you a sample. Well, let me see it then. Come on, man. This is not a nice neighborhood. I do not travel with the junk sample. Listen, man, I don't see no sample. I don't see the stuff. What the hell am I buying here, huh? Hey, well, I ain't heard no numbers yet. That's because you ain't set a price yet, chump change. Sixty grand, then. You can have it for sixty grand. Listen, brother, I know where the stuff's coming from, right? I'm gonna give you 25. You'll be whistling straight through the Christmas, all right? 25? There it is. <laughs> it's stealing. <laughs> it's going out of business sale, you know? You hang tight. Stuff. Must be getting it from Larry. Showtime, let's go. Yeah, I guess. can't have had those two kilos on them. They still got to get together for that. So you're gonna live or what? I feel fabulous. Come on. Okay, thanks. You know it's like banging your head against the wall. Crane was in it this deep and they cut him loose. Yeah, forget it. We were at the guy all night. I mean, if he knew where the guy was, we would have got her out of him. Yeah, but he was all we had. He was nothing. 
Someone ought to protect our damn rights sometimes. Tell me about it. Mid-South, Jim Bone. Okay. It's Nicole. I've been trying to get you all night. What's the matter? What, what, what's wrong? He's taken his off-duty gun. I don't know where he went. Okay, uh... Don't worry, we'll find him. No time for games. What the hell's going on? Look, man, I don't know. I just set the thing up. I don't you want to get what up? Of... What are you talking about? You don't talk to your partner or no. what? No. You're doing this stuff with Jefferson. Where? Where? Bar over at Clarence. On Clarence? Hey, you just ruined my whole number here. You gonna be okay on this? I think I earned my living. Take it easy. I'll be waiting here. Yeah? You don't want to come along and pick up a point or two? Say, you got the stuff or what? Hey, you got the bread, man. All it takes a little faith, brother. <laughs> well, you give me the cash and I'll get the faith, all right? Hey, hey, hey what's going on here, man? Nice to steal fingers. Didn't your mother never tell you not to do that? Hey, you, you guys got something you want to talk about? Okay, I'm just shopping, you know what I mean? When you're buying, you buy from me. You understand that? I will! Do it right next time you don't get hurt. Where is he? Maybe. Us, for sure. All right! All right. Don't hit me anymore. All you have to do is look around to see how stupid it was. You think you're on sick leave because we like to pay cops and do nothing? You're on sick leave because you're not healthy enough to protect yourself or anybody else out here with you. Doesn't matter to me if you haven't got enough sense to care about your own job. I happen to care about mine. One more stunt like this, you're gonna hear from me first and internal affairs next. I'm going home as I take care of it. And you? I don't know what your excuse is, and I don't want to know. But if anything like this happens again, your commanding officer is gonna get a personal letter from me with copies to every inspector in the department. That's gonna put you back on a beat so fast you won't even be able to find a uniform. Don't start with me. I don't know. Most beaches, everybody's entitled to one dumb move now and again. Thank you very much. How you doing? Who with? Those guys are your lieutenant. <laughs> Tell you what, though, man. Next time you want to go down an alley, how about let me do the backup, huh? Anytime. Mason Street Freight Yard. You want them near yours. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks ain't nothing, man. You owe me one, O'Brien. One dumb move. Now you're working on two? It's something I gotta do. Maybe. Maybe you're just massaging your ego. You ever think of that? Tommy, you know me better than that. I don't want to write your obituary. Not a chance. You got a speech for me, too? No speech. Hey, if it happened to me, I'd do the same thing. I just wouldn't screw up so bad.
turn here. This isn't the way to your place. I gotta pick up something I left. Should really call us in, you know, Obi. We can handle it. Is that the way you want it? That is the way I want it. Crane. Get your hands up, and very slowly turn around. And toss the gun on the ground in front of you. Now. A score settled, a death avenged, things evened up. When it all goes smooth, we call it justice, very civilized stuff. But every now and then, we get a glimpse of the raw jungle realities that lie just beneath that smooth surface. And what do we call it then? Mickey? Okay. 